Hi everybody, it's Juliana and today I'm here to share with you guys a project that I put together and this is using the kit that Melanie from Flirt By Me sent me and if you guys haven't seen this gorgeous kit um, I will put the link of my video where I share the kit um, so you guys can watch it but the kit comes with some amazing embellishments and trims and flowers and even some handmade flowers from Melanie and I had so so much fun putting this together and I wanted to share it with you all so um, my doily book as you can see it's inside this box and um, I was able to create a box as well for it because um, I don't want the doily book to get all dusty and dirty and so I figured that um, creating like a storage uh, box for it probably would be a good idea and that way I can also display it so I will show you the box here first and then I'll show you the doily book so for the box here, um, this is a um, wood box that I bought at my local craft store and um, the cool thing about this box is that it is glass here on the top and um, I absolutely love it because then you can actually see the mini album, all the things that you create um, on the inside. So uh, what I did for it is I just added some this beautiful trim that I received from the kit and I love these, these are hearts and these are super super fun. Um, I added this trim on the front and along with this beautiful butterfly that was also included in the kit. And pretty much everything that I use, it's in the kit. So <laughs> I'll just say that so I don't keep saying that. But um, yeah, I added this gorgeous trim here with these beautiful flowers. And I absolutely love this. It's kind of like very vintage. And the flowers are so, so, so darling. So cute. So I added that trim all around the box and over here. And the sides of the box, I just left it like the, reg the regular color that it comes with. Um, it's like a neutral, you know, wood color. And I didn't want to paint it or anything like that because um, I wanted the colors to really pop out. So um, that's what I did there. And sorry for the glare on my window here. I'm trying not to... Um, uh, tilted this way so then you don't see that but um, this is the beautiful flower that Melanie, uh, Melanie sorry, had sent to me um, with her beautiful kit and I love it so so much she had made this and I thought it was such a special flower that I would put it in my box here um, so it has doilies and buttons and then this little pin as well was part of the kit so I added it right here and the gorgeous rose flower here that I love, love this with um, this beautiful little flower. So just very darling. It came already with all these laces, which is super, super cute. And so that's what the box looks like from the front. And um, now let me go ahead and share it with you the doily book inside. So I'm going to get it out. And show you the box here so without the doily box uh, doily book excuse me this is what the box looks like so all right so I'm gonna put this on the side and I'm gonna show you the doily book here so let me try to get a little closer but I absolutely love this and I have to say that this is officially my first doily book ever <laughs> so i was really really thankful for the kit because then everything was in the kit and it was just so much easier to put together than to trying to find all the embellishments to match it so um i have to say that was awesome um so let me go ahead and show you what this kit looks like Okay, so I took my camera off the tripod so that way I can show you much, much easily. Um, but this is the, the doily book. It's quite large. The doilies are pretty large that I used that she included in there. And um, yeah, I love it. So what I did with the fabric is I created a bow. And I love this because it has some really nice roses, uh, very vintage colors, and I really love the combination um, of all of the embellishments together. 
so I cut out one of these beautiful appliques that she had sent and then added this one that has all the pearls in it it's so so beautiful and then to added a rosette flower with one of the smaller flowers that she included as well there and um, it kind of creates a really cool um, centered piece and then I added the tassel uh, trim here below along with um, this shabby uh, pink rosette trim love love those flowers and then this beautiful uh, trim also which is kind of like a Venice trim so instead of doing my doily book um, opening to the left it actually opens up so um, what I did to attach the pages it's I used some of the yarn that she had also sent there and I kind of tied it together in two small bows there on the front so there we go so we're gonna look up the first page so I'm gonna turn it this way to show you and I love all these little tassels in the strims they are so beautiful and what I did with this page is I created a pocket using a piece of the fabric. So there's room here for photos or little keepsakes. Um, I glued this uh, doily and I used fabric tack and um, also used my hot glue gun um, to add this embellishment. So just a combination of both. Um, and then I added this beautiful sentiment that she sent. It says memories and created a little bow using this gorgeous trim too that she had sent. So that is the first page. And then the second page right here. Um, I use this gorgeous image that she already printed in fabric. So it's ready to go. And I added a trim on the edges and then this precious sentiment here I did a ruffle type of uh, trim with the fabric and then added this beautiful uh, flower set here it's a ribbon flower and then some pieces of doily along with this beautiful trim here on the bottom it's so so super gorgeous I love this kit and I'm so happy to had the chance to create with it. Um, in this page, there is another little beautiful vintage girl and some doilies. And um, I added some doilies here in the back and the more um, of these dingles. And then um, I added this beautiful piece of jewelry that she had also sent there to the flower and this button. I love love these sunny buttons that she had included in the kit okay. and then there is this page here um, I love this this is uh, again one of the vintage girls I love this image so much and then with the same ribbon that I used for the box I created a bow for it and some doilies again I tried to use everything that she sent me on the kit so um, this is a floral flower here um, and yes I love this this is like so much fun <laughs> I absolutely love it and then the back I added just uh, one of the leftover doilies uh, here in white and then I added this trim here on the bottom as well so then it gives more volume of the dingles and there it is, a vintage uh, shabby chic doily book and I absolutely love, love love how it turned out. So that goes with the box here and that is it. So if you guys are interested in purchasing this kit, I will put the link of Melanie's Etsy store where you can find it and make a book for yourself. I hope that you guys like this project and found inspiration um thank you so much melanie for the opportunity to design with this gorgeous gorgeous kit and i will be back again to show you guys another project thank you so very much for watching and if you have any questions please let me know in the comments below take care everybody and bye bye